Hi, and welcome to Manatee Local. This is a primer on our primary elections for this year. We'll be done in under four minutes. Primary elections are used to select the final candidate for a political party for the general election in November. So this determines who's on the ballot in November. In Florida, primaries are closed primaries. That means that only members of that party can vote to select a party's final candidate for the general election in November. Florida voters put in a constitutional amendment to make a primary race open to all voters if there's no competing candidate from any other party candidates or any NPAs as well, so Green Party, Democrats, you know. However, it was later determined that write-in candidates counted as competition, even though their names will not appear on the ballot in November. Qualified write-ins, that is. As a result, fake candidates like Thomas Dell register as write-in candidates to deny large segments of communities their right to vote in a primary election. That leaves voters two choices. You either register for that party so that you can participate or don't vote at all until November. And whoever's on the ballot is there. Remember, party switching is your legal right and it's not rigging an election to change your party affiliation. You have to be registered in that party 29 days before the primary election. It's called book closing. And that was on July 22nd, 2024 this year. In counties with a heavy partisan lean, like ours, some elections will basically be decided in the local primary election in August. Several races will basically be decided in August, this, in actually a couple weeks, in Manatee County. The supervisor of elections and the property appraiser are the most prominent races that will be decided. A large number of races are already over with no opposition at all. The clerk of court and the sheriff are the most prominent races, but there are more like the CDDs and Mosquito and whatever. School board races are not partisan races, so everyone can vote for the school board candidates. These races will be decided in August and will not be on the ballot in November. The property appraisers race is an open primary because the write-in candidate withdrew from the race. All voters will be able to vote for the property appraiser in the August primary, even Democrats and NPAs. Because there is no further competition in that race, the primary will determine who will be the property appraiser and that race will not be on the ballot in November. It will be over in August. The primary election is the most important local election this year and most years, but this year especially. The primary election day is August 20th, 2024. Early voting begins August 10th, 2024 and closes August 17th, 2024. Plan accordingly. Check your registration. Make sure you know where your polling place is and how to get there. But most importantly, do your research on these candidates. Check their records, check their platforms. Do not rely on the glossy mailers. They are a paid front. Thank you and may the odds be ever in our favor.